Quark or quarg is a type of fresh dairy product made by warming soured milk until the desired amount of curdling is met, and then straining it. It can be classified as fresh acid set cheese. Traditional quark can be made without rennet, but in modern dairies small quantities of rennet are typically added. It is soft, white and unaged, and usually has no salt added. It is traditional in the cuisines of German-speaking, Slavic and Scandinavian countries. Dictionaries sometimes translate it as curd cheese, cottage cheese, farmer cheese or junket. In Germany, quark and cottage cheese are considered to be different types of fresh cheese, while in Eastern Europe cottage cheese is usually viewed as a type of quark e.g. Russian for cottage cheese is Zernenij Tvorog, Zernyani Tv Orog, literally, grainy quark. Quark is similar to French fromage blanc, Indian paneer, and the queso fresco, queso fresco made in the Iberian Peninsula and in some Latin American countries. It is distinct from Italian ricotta because ricotta Italian, recooked, is made from scalded whey. Quark is somewhat similar to yogurt cheeses such as the South Asian chalk K -A, the Arabic labna, and the Central Asian suzma or kashk, but while these products are obtained by straining yogurt milk fermented with thermophile bacteria, quark is made from soured milk fermented with mesophile bacteria. Name Quark is possibly described by Tacitus in his book Germania as lac concretum, thick milk, eaten by Germanic peoples. However, this could also have meant soured milk or any other kind of fresh cheese or fermented milk product. Although quark is sometimes referred to loosely as a type of cottage cheese, they can be distinguished from the different production aspects and textural quality, with the cottage cheese grains described as more chewy or meaty. Topic. Etymology The word quark Late Middle High German, quark, twarc, zwarg, Lower Saxon, dwarg, with usage in German documented since the 14th century, is thought to derive from a West Slavic equivalent, such as Lower Sorbian Tuarog, Upper Sorbian Tuero, Polish Tuarog, Czech and Slovak Tvaro, and is also cognate with Russian TV Orog, Tvorog Bulgarian Tvarog, Tvarog and Belarusian, Tvarog, Tvarog the original Old Slavonic asterisk Tvarog Tvarog, is supposed to be related to the Church Slavonic Tver, tr, tvor, meaning, form. The meaning can thus be interpreted as, milk that solidified and took a form. The word formation is thus similar to that of the Italian formaggio and French fromage. More cognates and forms the Slavic words may also be cognate with Greek name for cheese tyros turos. A cognate term for quark, turo, is used in Hungarian. Cognates also occur in Scandinavia, Danish K -vark, Norwegian and Swedish K -v -a -r -g, and the Netherlands. Dutch quark. The Old English form is gewior, other German forms include quark, and quargel. Topic. Other names In several languages, quark is also known as white cheese. French, fromage blanc, Southern German, Ykes or Y or Kass, Hebrew, Gabin Lbnh translate, Gavina Levana, Lithuanian, Baltas Surus, Polish, Bialy Eser, Serbian, Beli Sur, as opposed to any rennet set, yellow cheese. Another French name for it is fromage phrase, fresh cheese, where the difference to fromage blanc is defined by French legislation. A product named fromage phrase must contain live cultures when sold, whereas with fromage blanc fermentation has been halted. In Swiss French, it is usually called serre. In Austria, the name Topfen pot cheese is common. In Flanders, it is called platikos flat cheese. In Finnish, it is known as raka, while in Estonian as kohapiim foamy milk, in Lithuanian as varskis surus curd cheese, and in Latvian as bispians thick milk. Its Italian name is jinkata or cogliata curd. Among the Albanians quark is known as gies. Topic. Production Quark is a member of the acid set cheese group, whose coagulation mainly relies on the acidity, produced by lactic acid bacteria feeding on the lactose. 
but moderate amounts of rennet have also been in use, both at the home consumption level and the industrial level. Manufacture of cork normally uses pasteurized skim milk as main ingredient, but cream can be added later to adjust fat content. The lactic acid bacteria are introduced in the form of mesophilic lactococcus starter cultures. In the dairy industry today, cork is mostly produced with a small quantity of rennet, added after the culture when the solution is still only slightly acidic pH Acidification allowed to continues until the pH reaches around 4.6, at which acidity level the casein proteins in the milk begins to precipitate. In Germany, the curd is continuously stirred to prevent it from getting hard, resulting in a thick, creamy texture. According to German regulations on cheese, fresh cheeses, frischkäse, such as cork or cottage cheese, must contain at least 73% water in the fat-free component. German cork is usually sold in plastic tubs with most or all of the whey. This type of cork has the firmness of sour cream but is slightly drier, resulting in a somewhat crumbly texture like ricotta. The basic cork contains about 0.2% fat. This basic cork or skimmed cork must under German law have less than 10% fat by dry mass. Cork with higher fat content is made by adding cream after cooling. It has a very smooth and creamy texture and is slightly sweet, unlike sour cream. A firmer version called schichtkäse layer cheese, is often used for baking. Schichtkäse is distinguished from cork by having an added layer of cream sandwiched between two layers of cork. Cork is also often sold flavored with herbs, spices, or fruit. In general, dry mass of cork has 1% to 40% fat, most of the rest is protein 80% of which is casein, calcium, and phosphate. In the 19th century, there was no industrial production of cork as end product and it was produced entirely for home use. In the traditional homemade process, the milk would be allowed to let stand until it soured naturally by the presence of naturally occurring bacteria, although the hardening could be encouraged with the addition of some rennet. Some or most of the whey is removed to standardize the cork to the desired thickness. Traditionally, this is done by hanging the cheese in a muslin bag or a loosely woven cotton gauze called cheesecloth and letting the whey drip off, which gives cork its distinctive shape of a wedge with rounded edges. In industrial production, however, cheese is separated from whey in a centrifuge and later formed into blocks. Most of the Austrian and other Central and Eastern European varieties contain less whey and are therefore drier and more solid than the German and Scandinavian ones. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Russian style. Under Russian governmental regulations, TV orog is distinguished from cheeses, and classified as a separate type of dairy product. Typical TV orog usually contain 65-80% water out of the total mass. The Israeli Gavina Levana is a creamy variety similar to the German types of quark. The Russian-style cork was introduced to Israel during the Aliyah of the 1990s by immigrants from the former Soviet Union, and is now available under the name TV orog. Topic common uses Various cuisines feature cork as an ingredient for appetizers, salads, main dishes, side dishes and desserts. In Germany, cork is sold in cubic plastic tubs and usually comes in three different varieties, magerquark skimmed cork, regular cork 20% fat in dry mass and sanniquark creamy cork, 40% fat in dry mass with added cream. Similar gradations in fat content are also common in Eastern Europe. While magerquark is often used for baking or is eaten as breakfast with a side of fruit or muesli, sanniquark also forms the basis of a large number of cork desserts called corkspies when homemade or cork desert when sold in German. Much like yogurts in some parts of the world, these foods mostly come with fruit flavoring fructoquark, fruit cork, sometimes with vanilla and are often also simply referred to as cork. Dishes in German-speaking areas One common use for the cork is in making cheesecake called Kassekuchen or Korkkuchen in Germany. Quark cheesecake is called Topfenkuchen in Austria. The cork torte in Switzerland may be equivalent, though this has also been described as a tort that combines cork and cream. There is also the cork tart in neighboring Netherlands. 
In these cakes, the cork is typically mixed with eggs, milk or cream, and sugar, and baked or fried. In Austria, Topfen is commonly used in baking in popular desserts like Topfenkuchen as already mentioned, Topfenstrudel and Topfenpalatschinken a form of crepes. Cork is also often used as an ingredient for sandwiches, salads, and savory dishes. Cork, vegetable oil and wheat flour are the ingredients of a popular kind of dough, called Korkolteig, used in German cuisine as an alternative to yeast leavened dough in home baking, since it is considerably easier to handle and requires no rising period. The resulting baked goods look and taste very similar to yeast leavened goods, although they do not last as long and are thus usually consumed immediately after baking. In Germany, cork mixed with chopped onions and herbs like parsley and chives is called Krauterquark. Krauterquark is commonly eaten with boiled potatoes and has some similarity to tzatziki which is based on yogurt. Quark with linseed oil and potatoes is the national dish of the Sorbs in Lusatia. Quark also has been used among Ashkenazi Jews. <laughs> <laughs> Slavic countries Desserts using quarks Russian, tvarog, etc. in Slavic regions include the Tvarohovnik in Slovakia, Tvaroznik in Czech Republic, Cernik in Poland, and Cernik in Ukraine and cheese pancakes Cierniki in Russia and Ukraine. In Poland, tvarog is mixed with mashed potatoes to produce a filling for pierogi. Tvarog is also used to make gnocchi-shaped dumplings called lenaway pierogi, lazy pierogi. Ukrainian recipes for Veroniki or Lazy Veroniki are similar but TV Orog and mashed potatoes are different fillings which are usually not mixed together. In Russia, Ukraine, and Belarus, TV Orog Russian, Tvorog is highly popular and is bought frequently by almost every family. As a result, TV Orog is a member of the official minimal basket of foods in Russia. In Russian families, it is especially recommended for growing babies. It can be enjoyed simply with sour cream, or jam, sugar, sugar-condensed milk, or as a breakfast food. It is often used as a stuffing in blinchiki offered at many fast-food restaurants. It is also commonly used as the base for making Easter cakes. It is mixed with eggs, sugar, raisins and nuts and dried into a solid pyramid-shaped mass called paska. The mass can also be fried, then known as sirniki. In Latvia, quark is eaten savory mixed with sour cream and scallions on rye bread or with potatoes. In desserts, quark is commonly baked into bispiena platsmes, a crusted sheet cake baked with or without raisins. A sweetened treat bispiena sirens small curd cheese is made of small sweetened blocks of quark dipped in chocolate. Estonian quark is evaluated on olfaction, vision, taste, aftertaste, and texture and is distributed nationally as well as to nearby regions. Dishes including quark. Topic: <inaudible> Availability in other countries. Although common in continental Europe, manufacturing of quark is rare in the Americas. A few dairies manufacture it, such as the Vermont Creamery in Vermont, and some specialty retailers carry it. Lifeway Foods manufactures a product under the title Farmer Cheese which is available in a variety of metropolitan locations with former Russian populations. Ellie Quark, a Californian manufacturer of quark, offers soft quark in different flavors. In Canada, the firmer East European variety of quark is manufactured by Liberté Natural Foods. A softer German-style quark is manufactured in the Didsbury, Alberta, plant of Calgary-based Foothills Creamery. Glengarry Fine Cheesemaking in Lancaster Eastern Ontario also produces quark. Also available in Canada is the very similar dry curd cottage cheese manufactured by Dairyland. Quark may also be available as baking cheese, pressed cottage cheese, or fromage fraise. In Australia, Ukrainian traditional quark is produced by Blue Bay Cheese in Mornington Peninsula. It is also sometimes available from supermarkets labeled as quark or quark. In New Zealand, European traditional quark is produced by Caracas in North Canterbury. It is available in 350 grams pots and available online and in speciality stores such as Moore Wilson's. In the United Kingdom, fat-free quark is produced by several independent manufacturers based throughout the country. All the big four supermarkets in the UK sell their own branded quark, as well as other brands of quark. Um, 
Topic See also Clabber food Mazithra List of ancient dishes and foods List of German cheeses List of cheeses equals equals explanatory notes <laughs>